Hey, curl friends, and welcome back to Coconuts, home of the Long Hair Society. Look at here. What's up? What we got going on over here? How 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 we got here? I mean, I uh, uh, you know what? <laughs> I don't know what to say. But she came and she's like, "I'm done. I'm done with this natural hair journey. I can't do it no more." And I'm like, "Calm down, girl. Calm down." What's going on? She like, it's too much. It's just too much for me. She don't know what to do with it. It's too big. Now, y'all, this is my big sister. And I convinced her to start the natural hair journey a couple of months after I started mine, which is about like six years ago. And it didn't take much convincing because she was bald headed too. She ain't had no edges just like me. We was just two bald headed sisters. Fast forward years later, I help her get her hair real long, real thick, thicker than it's ever been in her life, longer than it's ever been in her life. But like most things in life, when you give people certain things, they don't know how to care for it. You know what I'm saying? But no, honestly, natural hair is hard. And she is not a hairstylist. She don't know how to comb hair at all. She be trying, but it's a lot. Natural hair ain't for the weak. You have to learn all kind of techniques, especially if you've never been the type to do your hair. This can be a nightmare sometimes. You know, you think you're going to get a head full of curls and it turns out you have a head full of naps and you don't know what to do. Knots, tangles, build up, all kind of stuff. And you just walk around looking a little crazy. She was like, listen, I'm dealing with a newborn baby. I don't want to deal with this natural hair. I'm ready to straighten my hair. She was actually talking some craziness, talking about she thinking about putting like a little texturizer, or relaxing her hair. Then she was asking about keratin treatment. Then she was asking about the Japanese straightening. I'm like, hold on, girl, relax. Calm down. You going too far. I mean, come on now. Let's think about this before you make a big permanent decision. Okay, calm down. And breathe. I, at first, I felt a little disrespected. Because I'm like, uh-uh, you done pimped me to grow your nappy hair all this time just for you to go back in on that creamy crack after all, all, all this stuff we've been through with your hair? Yeah, I was feeling some type of way. But then I had to just be like, you know what? It's her hair and it's hard work. And she ain't going to have me as her personal hairstylist forever. Because remember, I told you, I, my man coming to get me. And he going to fly me off to Abu Dhabi. And we going to be traveling on yachts across the sea. So she ain't really going to have me as her personal stylist for too long. So she has to figure out something. So I said, how about we try to heat train your hair since the weather is getting a lot cooler in South Florida? And she was like, I don't know. I think I just want to go ahead and do a keratin treatment. Or I just think I want to do some type of relaxing. And I'm like, no, no, this is where I draw the line. You ain't, you ain't going to do that. It, it, no. Girl, I can barely speak making this video. Because you know, y'all know how I feel about natural hair. And I feel like she tested my gangster and just trying to pull it out me. But I ain't going to let her pull it out me. Okay? I'm going to just, you know, I'm going to give her options. Okay? So I tell her, listen... We're going to give you a soft press. We're going to soft launch your straight look that you're going for, just in case you don't like it, just in case a new hairstyle comes out in the next month or two and you're okay with trying that, or just in case you want to just go back to protective styling and growing out your length. She kind of still don't want to hear it. She's just like, whatever, girl. I just don't know if this natural thing for me anymore. And I'm like, no. <laughs> yes, it is, sis. Yes, it is trust me so i'm like okay crystal give her something to satisfy her and just hold her over for like a couple of months because i don't want her to go i know her she would try to sneak and go to some stylists and let them do something to her hair because she know i won't so i'm gonna have to work with her because i don't want nobody messing up my sister hair i spent so much time in her hair and i'm so proud of her where her hair came because she used to have really fine thin hair like really feathery and on this journey by switching to natural products switching to natural shampoos for so many years her hair is so full even though the strands are still fine she still has a lot more strands than she ever did in her whole life and she is happy with the length so she does not mind going fully straight so 
what I'm going to do today is still care for her hair as much as I can using natural products. You've seen me detangle with the Main Magic Elixir and the Main Magic Growth Sauce just to make sure her hair is detangled before I go ahead and colored her hair. After I colored her hair, I rinsed out her hair color and now it's time for me to section and get it ready for a blow dry. So I'm just combing her hair through and let me just tell you about something. When I was washing her hair, I was using another brand shampoo and conditioner because like I said, she's going to be getting a straightened look. So I, I didn't use a natural shampoo because natural shampoo is just not going to cleanse your strand to the point where all the oils are stripped if you wanted to go ahead and press your hair out so i had to use a different brand shampoo and conditioner and i was not used to those steps no more girl i had to shampoo twice use the conditioner then they had a deep treatment it was just like dang I mean, ever since I switched to natural shampoos and you only got to shampoo your hair and that's good enough and you keep it moving, I've been spoiled. So someone left a comment under one of my videos and it went like this. I need a natural remedy that texturizes constantly tangling and knotting hair, even after patiently detangling, feeding it with conditioned water and plaiting it. Afro hair has been in existence for hundreds of thousands of years with natural treatments for almost every other thing found in plants, clay, etc. Why has an organic texturizer been found yet? And where are the black hair care businesses backed by black scientists with inventions that healthy, slightly loosen, extreme coiled hair, which instinctively wraps around itself in knots? I don't want to go down the chemical route, but it seems like that is my only option if I want my hair to have a chance of growing without breaking. Hmm. That's right, sis. Preach. I'm feeling you 100%. Where are all these black billionaires they claim they got them Kanye Wests and them Magic Johnsons and, and who the other one? Tyler Perry. Don't y'all got billions of dollars? Oh, yeah. Let me not forget Oprah. Y'all got all y'all money? Y'all don't know no black sciences to, to go sit down and talk to them about this hair situation? Oh, it's because y'all don't think hair is a big situation. That hair is not important. Okay. It looked like I'm going to have to do it. Okay, but right now, I'm using this cheese system. I don't know how it's going to work in her hair. You know, I'm just trying to use it because it's a thermal, supposedly a thermal treatment system. And it's paraben-free, sulfate-free. And they trying, but at the end of the day, who knows? You know what I'm saying? But I would rather develop some type of natural system. There got to be a clay out there. There got to be some remedy out there, some mixture that, some potion. And I'm going to get to the bottom of it. But for now, we're going to use good products and good tools, including the Sunmay Volga 2-in-1 Hair Straightener. Now, this hair straightener is designed with anion generator that can release 49 million negative ions, lets you achieve sleek, frizz-free hairstyles in total comfort. It's wireless, it's portable, and it's small. It has three temperature levels, and it heats up quickly. Make sure you guys follow Sunmay on all their social media platforms. I'm talking about Instagram, YouTube, Facebook. This is a really cool flat iron. At first, I was skeptical because I was like, this looked like a Tesla. But it really does help get the hair really sleek. I mean, her hair was so straight. I was kind of nervous. I was like, hold up. I ain't going to even use the highest setting right now. We're going to take it easy because this is a soft press. But this flat iron is a must. Everyone should have a cordless portable flat iron because trust me, it's going to be a time where you're going to need to relay your wig, relay your hair, and you're going to need a flat iron and you can just pull it out in your car, pull it out on the plane, pull it out on a ship. Come on now. Listen, that's innovation, right? So after I am done curling her hair with the two-in-one straightener, I am going to add some growth drops because even though she is going on this straight journey, it's a right and a wrong way to do everything. So I made sure I used the best products, the best 
best of the best tools. And I also made sure that I still incorporated plenty of natural products because at the end of the day, your hair is going to need all that extra vitamins and strength as you change your hair strands into a different texture. Whenever you're feeling frustrated with your natural hair, always remember that your hair is magic and it's literally a transformer. So sometimes take a break from your curls. Go get a silk press. Enjoy it and rock it. And trust me, you'll be back because long hair is your destiny and big hair is your birthright. And that's